Hey, what's up, guys? It's Big Marv here, and welcome back to my 100 day challenge. Today, we're gonna be um, going over a service funnel. This is a funnel where he has multiple different products and services that we he offers. So, it's basically gonna be like a storefront where his end users can um, let's go on here and select whatever, whatever he wants or whatever they want rather and buy it directly through the funnel. We're gonna have a couple of different product page options. So, you know, strap in. This is day 91. Let's get some stuff done. Alright. Here's the funnel right now. Right now I have it all built into one page um, where they can buy the different things from here. But what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to create this page as the landing page where they can pick pick um, what they want and then I'm going to forward them over to two other order pages to actually get the product so what we're going to do is I'm going to clone each funnel step or I'm going to clone this funnel step twice And this one is going to be the build of the package. Clone that again. Except this one is going to be um, subscriptions. Subscriptions. All right, so now we're going to go into here. And so he sent me over this value ladder here that has all the different items that he sells. And so you can see up here. Five, six, seven, eight. So I'm going to drag this over to my other monitor just so I can see it. So we have the section 609, and it's a... 249 value, how to deal with collection agencies and when, it's a $790 value, how to effectively build credit history, $290 value. Dispute strategies. That's going to be a $14.99 value. How to win at the dealership. That is a $1,250 value. Complete credit repair. Uh, law letter library. Library. Complete do it yourself kit. It is a twelve ninety nine value. All masterclass webinars. And all credit professor priceless. So right now I have this button set to scroll to the bottom. I'm gonna go get the different URL button so say build your package. Alright, 
Let me save this and then go back and grab the URL for the next step. This is the builder package, so I'll just open this in a new tab, grab this URL, back in here, alright, so here's the URL right here, open the same window, alright. And then here's our next. So we have the gold package. That's what this is the platinum package. So the platinum package is 259 down and 199 monthly. We get the comprehensive. Credit enhancement after six months. I guess that's no longer a bonus. I'm guessing this is no longer a bonus. Alright, now I need to update that check mark to an arrow so that they all match. Alright, there we go. And then start changing today. Sorry for my pen. And then let's see. It was 259 down. So I'm going to get rid of this. All in all together. I'm put 259, 259 down, and 199 monthly. Alright, and then we're going to kill that. I need to go grab that, the link to the other, the other page in the funnel. Why is it? Oh my fucking god. Fucking take this fucking URL. Shit. Thank you.
Alright, so now I can't go platinum yet. I'm gonna fucking ditch this. Basic current, personal information correction, monthly 30 minute coaching. Dispute negative items, discount. Removal judgments, tax lien, bankruptcy. 24-7 portal and six months of credit bureau responses so I'm going to get rid of this alright so that aligns with his package and then this one is $199 down and $99 And then the link, like I said, we're going to get rid of the scroll to the bottom. And then we're going to get rid of this. Get rid of this. Get all of this today is going to be six eight seven seven six ninety seven. All right, and then let me do that math real quick and make sure that they sent me correct numbers. Let's see, two forty nine plus seven ninety plus seven ninety again. Plus $14.99 plus $12.50 plus $9.99 plus $12.99 6 8 7 6 oh, somebody fucked up somewhere. Alright. That's pretty much it. We're gonna, he's going to do a video here that it basically tells them, you know, you know, and I can go ahead and add that because I don't have the video yet, but I'll add the element so we know the placeholder is there. Alright, and then I'm going to clone this divider, drag it up here. Give it a margin. All right. Cool. So that's the landing page. That's going to direct them to the next steps in the funnel. All right. So now on the build a package, what we're going to do is and get rid of this. Or actually, what I will do is this. What the fuck? Second. All right. So let's see how am I going to do this? Because what we're going to be doing is um, we're going to have them enter the information to actually build their package. Actually, you know what? I'll drop this two step. And instead of enter your info, I'm going to say build your package below. All right. 
and then I'm going to add the two column row. Alright, I gotta fix all these fucking numbers again because I wasn't smart and I cloned it <laughs> before I, I updated the new numbers, but that's cool. So 249. There we go. So now I'm going to add all this select. Where is it? Billing. Here we go. We need a billing address. And we need a couple inputs. For name, name, email, and phone. Name, email, phone, that information. Then we'll do the credit card. And then we will do um, order summary. Come on, fuck. Alright. This will be their information dynamically updated, card number. Summary, and then we need a submit button. Set this to submit. Uh, make the button uh, the same width as the column. So where is it? Oh, shadow. No, no, no. It's not a shadow. Why is it not in here? Oh, here it is, button with. Alright. So now what I'm going to do is add products in here. And I'm just going to add a few to show you guys how it looks. Um, because really we need to get this payment processor set up and we still haven't sorted that out.
Alright, and we're not sending unique emails, so we're just going to erase this email integration. He has active campaign. And we're going to add him to. Alright, so I guess I got to go into active campaign and set this list up, so I'm not doing that yet either. Alright, I gotta fucking refresh this apparently because ClickFunnels is tripping fucking dick right now. So I want you guys to imagine that we added all these different products in here. I'm only adding three for the purpose of this video, but you can see here he has several products, seven different products up here, and then of course the package, so that'd be eight all together. Um, and there is a CF Pro Tool script I'm going to use. to give me checkboxes instead of the radio button so I can select multiple things. So give me a second here. How the fuck? Oh, here he is. So this is the multi-product script. Like I said, this script is going to turn uh, the radio buttons into checkboxes. You just put it inside your tracker code. Oh, it looks like I already have it here. So let's see how it looks. So you can see how we have the different items, so we can select multiple items. Oh, and it's not updating the order summary, so I need to grab that code. Alright, so that's in there. So now I just need to add the styling. Alright, 
save. Now let's see how that works. Alright. So now you can see when you select multiple items, it just adds it all up. So this is why they can build a package basically. They, they'll be able to select any of these items that they want. Or they can select the complete course combo package and get it all for 697. So it'll be on the end user to do that. So that looks good. Alright, so now I'm going to go back and build out the subscription page. The subscription page doesn't have those other packages in it. So I'm going to ditch this top section completely. And then here we go. Here's our Pokemon Platinum package and the gold package. And they both still go down to this button. That's fine. They can fill that out. And then another section he wants to add is a diamond package. So we're going to modify this top one to be the diamond protection. Diamond protection package and that includes unlimited disputes. Customize. What is it? I'm just going to copy it. I'll just get rid of that check mark. Very weekly calls. Alright, and then this package is because there is no pricing so I'm going to change it to um, sign up for my diamond package and then what we're going to say Alright, and then I'm gonna say book. I'm gonna say book now. I'm, and then I'm gonna take it out because it's, it's gonna be a different. You know, I'm gonna just make the button not do anything because it just doesn't have a calendar set up or anything. We need to figure out a better way to, um, you know, do this push that product basically um, but I'm probably gonna set up something like Lindy so if you take a look at book now 
www.marvinsworld.us you can see I have it set up to automatically book sessions with me so we'll probably set up something like this um, for end users that want to do this so let's take a look at that platinum again Person compensation, all advanced judgments, inquiry rem removal process, bi weekly calls, unlimited disputes. And then we're going to drop all this. Alright, and then we're going to get rid of this. Can you get him to not claw the door? Get rid of this, add this package because you know they're just going to order that package, and then they can still scroll to the bottom to actually purchase. And we're going to get rid of this. All right, so what's in the gold package? Basic personal information, monthly 30 minute coaching call. Dispute negative items, discount on advance, blah blah blah. 24 hour access, six months, so I'm gonna get rid of this too. Alright, and then instead of 169, it's 199 and 99 a month. Alright. So that's pretty easy. So now let's run through this funnel so I can show you guys how it's going to function. So basically from here they'll have a, a video that tells them, you know, select a button below to pick your package, go to package, do whatever you need to do. If they click this button, then it will take them here to build a package where they can, act, they can build one of their own package and purchase their own package that way. If they choose to not go with a DIY kit, you know, build your own package, then they can get one of these, the platinum package or the gold package, will say sign me up, and that takes them here, to where they can get diamond protection, platinum or gold. Alright, so now what I'm actually going to do is go back here to subscriptions, I'm going to save this top section as the diamond package. Alright. Now I can go back to that the first page and drop that diamond package right into it. Alright, so now you can see there. here's a DIY, here's a diamond package, here's a platinum. So now I'm going to grab this link. Actually, no, I'll just leave it here. We'll put the book call. We'll make the book call call to action right on the home page too. And then we'll leave it on the subscription. So if they change their mind by the time they get to the description, they can 
he'll have the option there too. Alright, so and you can see we have a custom URL freedom from your credit.com. Jumps you right here. So Alright, there we go. So that is it. Um, we're just going over you know this funnel. We have the final value ladder that he sent over to me. So we just modified an existing funnel that he had to do these updates because he updated his price on things. And um, and we changed it to where we have these two different order pages where we can manage two different sets of products. Um, and basically that, that way I don't have you know two different order forms trying to build it out. It's just going to be clunky and messy. Even though I do have the nice script that went from a radio button to a checkbox. But... It, they don't need the DIY kit if they hire him one on one that's why I didn't want it all on one page I want to give them the option to build a package or work one on one with them so if they want to build a package then they'll go to an order page specifically for that and if they want to get one of his subscription plans then they'll go to a page specifically for that and the product thank you page That's right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this link. All right. And then I'm going to go back to each one of these. And then I'm going to set it. If you go to settings general on submit, I can set it to automatically go to that thank you page. That way, once they submit their order, they'll automatically be directed to the right thank you page. Because if they submit their order here, then it'll automatically direct them to the subscriptions, which is not what we want to do. We'll do the same thing here. Alright, so that is good. And then let me just double check one more thing. We have the share link on here. I just want to make sure that is set up proper. Freedom from your credit.com. Yep. All right, cool. So you can see on the thank you page, you also want to always include a call to action. We have, you know, they can follow us on social media or they can share their friend with their friends. So it's two different call to actions. They can either follow us or share with their friends. They can even do both if they feel like it. But yeah. So this has been day 90, uh, 91, I believe. Maybe it's day 92. I don't know. Let me see. I can tell you guys for sure. <laughs> this is day 91 in the 100 Day Funnel Hacker Challenge. So thank you guys for tuning in. Get out there, hack some funnels. Drop your links below. I want to check them out. This is Big Marv. Thank you guys for tuning in. One love.